You see this? You see this? What's this? Oh, it's my Ipsy bag. That's all right. And this time I already took a peeky poo inside of it. And I actually am so glad that I did because everything that's in this bag was so hard to unwrap. It all had that plasticky stuff around it that takes me forever to open. So if you've not seen any of my other Ipsy bags, uh, unboxings go check those out because they're quite comical when I try to open them by the way if you're not subscribed go do that right now just click subscribe and you're done okay so let's get to it what's inside the first thing this was not inside the bag this was just inside the package this is a what kind large angle brush from Luxie uh, I mean it's a brush it's an angle brush it's large but not that large. It's like medium angle blush. So, but ma'am, I've never used this brand, know nothing about it, but that's that. The next thing, what do you think of the bag? I actually like this bag, cause I like me some pink, um, and this is a good shade of pink. Um, okay, I'm gonna start with the things, that, the thing I was not that impressed with, cause I have had a chance to kind of sample some of these. Okay, this is powder eyeshadow pearl fizz from this brand, what, Rob Sheppy for Teeny Beauty. It's got a martini glass on the front. I mean, this honestly was not that pigmented. It was not a fancy color to ride home about. I mean, that's a, it looks okayly pigmented there, but and he, nah, it's got like powdery stuff. I don't know. This is gonna go into my treasure box at school for my kids to use tickets on. Yeah, the girls love stuff like that. A lot of my Ipsy stuff that I don't use ends up for sale. Um, this I have not used. This is an exfoliating honey peel off mask for all skin types. Sometimes I'm hesitant to use stuff like this just cause, but the weirdest thing I felt, it says for directions of use, go to www.heyhoney.com. It's like, we're not going to tell you what to do with it or what it's for. Just go to our website to check it out. Mm, maybe, maybe not. Could be going in the treasure box. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Okay, and then there, there were other two makeup products in there, which this blush is by Model Co. Okay, and let me just be honest. When something's wrapped in plastic, you immediately think it's cheaper. And so... Everything I got this time, all three of these were wrapped in plastic, which immediately makes me think these are drugstore kind of products. I'm not familiar with these companies, but um, I did go ahead and use this blush, which it says it's blush on the front. That's how I knew. Um, it ha this It's just a pinky blush. And it was, I mean, it was a nice color, but the wear time on it, is not all that great. Not when I'm comparing it to my Tarte blushes or my um, the balm in stains. I mean, this is no stain power when you compare it to my Hourglass. Even just the finish, it's powdery. It's all right. If you if you don't if you don't have a whole blush collection, then you'll like this. But if you already have a blush collection, this is probably not gonna be something you reach for. The last thing, I actually was really excited when I saw it because I was like, ooh, I love that color. And it reminded me of my favorite MAC lip gloss, which is Saint Germain. I love that lip gloss, it's super pink. Um, and this, when I first got it out, not looking at them side by side, I was like, oh, that's it. This is not the same color, it's pretty. I do like this lip gloss, it is really pretty. It is just not the same, it's a milky, um, a much milkier pink than Mac St. Germain. So this looks really pretty swatched, but on the lips, it does not appear as pink as Mac St. Germain. I would say that this is a good to kind of like tone some lips down if you kind of want a nice gloss. I do like that this has no sparkle in it at all. It's just a a cream finish. So this, the, the texture is that of no, it's not a cream sheen. Um, it does have a texture like some of the matte glosses, but, and there's not really a smell that I remember. A little bit of one, but it's not got that vanilla-y smell. And this one is by Cargo, and it is in the color, I don't know how to say it. 
I'm probably supposed to be able to pronounce this. Y'all can pronounce it for me, if it'll focus. There you go. Is that focusing? Or is it backward? I hope it's backward. Why am I backward today? Everything's showing backward. Is that backward to you? It looks backward to me. If it's backward, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna do anything to fix it, but anywho. Um, I think I'm gonna like this little brush. I haven't used this one yet, but you, I can never have too many makeup brushes. Let's just be real. So that's what came in my Insta bag. I feel like I'm kind of down on it this time, but really it's because I've actually tried all the products. A lot of times I get really excited about my Insta bag, but that's because like I haven't tried anything yet. And sometimes after the fact, I'm not quite as excited as I was when I got it. But I'm just saying, if you are not a subscriber to Ipsy, I'm gonna leave the um, my little link below. Um, I don't get anything except like 100 points. So it's not gonna hurt my feelings if you don't use it. But um, for 10 bucks a month, and I got what five products even if I only really like one of them ten bucks is, you know I get to try different stuff that I normally wouldn't try so um, and if you like I subscribed for the entire year so it was cheaper it was like nine bucks a month that way so anywho, and I love the bags I do is that weird I love all these little bags okay yes it's weird but now I'm talking to myself instead of talking to you. So I will say goodbye for now and let me know what came in your Ipsy bag, okay? So leave in the comments what came in your Ipsy bag. And if you don't subscribe to Ipsy, then leave in the comments below which of the products that I had do you like the best. They all do have sort of a pink theme to them this, this month. I guess I should do a pink face day. That would be fun. Like Piglet. But that's a bad comparison. So anyhow, if you're not already subscribed, make sure you subscribe, make sure you like, and share with your friends, okay? I will see you soon. Bye.